For this compound, we have H3O+, and the first thing we'll do is look at the group number to determine the number of electrons. So for hydrogen, it's in group 1, so we have a 1, subscript of 3, 1 times 3, oxygen is 6, and then a plus charge, um, so 3 plus 6 is 9 um, total, but the thing is, we're not done, right, because there's a plus charge. So a plus charge means that it's a cation. A cation means that there's one less electron, right? Or I mean, there's less fewer electrons than protons. Um, so what we'll do is subtract one electron, right, from the total. Nine minus one is equal to eight. So our actual Lewis structure will look like this. So now we have to put a plus charge because of the formal charge of this oxygen. Now let's calculate the formal charge. So for formal charge, right, the first thing is the group number. So group number will be 6. Okay. So since the group number is 6, um, because oxygen is in group 6, then we subtract it from whatever is uh, we count right here. So we count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So 6 minus 5 will equal 1. So the formal charge will be 1. Um, so therefore we put plus one or we can just leave it as plus. Now the next thing is hybridization. So for this we count the number of domains. So one, two, three, four. Four domains in total. So we have one, right? One plus three is equal to four. Because remember that there's a one right here and the exponents have to equal the number of domains. So one plus three is four is equal to four domains so this oxygen will be sp3 hybridized. So I hope that helped and thanks for watching.